it's a story based game that will feature player choice the consequence of all your in-game actions and decision I was fucking reading that dicks oh there's, there's lightning So am I sleeping or am I fucking dead? Alright, I'm just looking at. Where am I? What's happening? I'm trapped in a storm? How did I get here? And where is here? Wait, there's a lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I you really believe you're gonna be safe in the middle of this fucking storm? Like, this is a violent fucking storm. I don't think you're gonna be safe from this storm. What the fuck is this? Look at that tree. It's fucking ugly looking tree there. You want me? You want me to walk you up to the lighthouse? Oh, I'll go up to the fucking lighthouse. I will walk up to the lighthouse at the slowest pace possible. What the fuck is that? Is that like a fucking tsunami hurricane? Is that a tsunami hurricane? I'm I'm just standing through that cloth. What the fuck is that though? I got. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? I just don't make any comments. You make it. Your name is Max. Holy shit. But oh, now you notice the fucking hurricane out there. That's a boat. That's a lot of was so surreal. He famously called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. Why the fuck color am I in school? I, now, I don't want to be in school. Can I quit the game? Perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Weird. Diane Arbus. Can I just quit the fucking game right now? I don't want to be in school. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the. That is one fat motherfucker back there. She saw humanity is tortured, right? You have purplish hair. Keep that to yourself. You have buns. Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. I guess she's getting special tutoring. Cause that looks too. He looks way too big to be a kid. You just you look like the snotty bitches over there. Isn't that too easy? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. They don't fucking show it. Just fucking shove it up your ass. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? Of Here, let me look at my innocence. fucking world-renowned pencil. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. I'm not a big fan of her work. Take a sip. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of post-war beach. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo You don't need to fucking tell the entire the class that I took a selfie with my goddamn 1700s fucking camera, you fucking expression. asshole of a teacher. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. 
What? I would like to applaud you for that painted on beard you have there. I imagine it took you good like what 30 40 minutes to fucking paint that on this morning when you woke up, dick. You're asking me? L let me think. Um you either know this or not, Max. Go up the fuck down, god damn. Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like Is this man. fucking even English Man's anymore? Totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Did you fucking Very just do Victoria. that? The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. Making so fucking my journal. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? October, my favorite month, the best one of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. Tiny flames! What the fuck? But it's still too damn hot. Thanks, global warming. Thanks, Obama. And I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet soon. Can't let me borrow the October Country by Brad. I don't fucking want to read all of this shit. She found a real Halloween party. Listen, I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is which one of you two fucking bitches was the one who said sad face? Because I'll fucking slap you upside your stupid fucking snotty head. You want me to read that? Do you want me to read that? I. Who? No, I'm not going. Life. True love waits. Yeah, sure, believe that. Although she's an adult, I bet she's not allowed to watch R rated films. Alright, no pirate movies for you then. Are you fucking Mark? Mark Wahlberg? Is this you? Mark Wahlberg? Those are the episodes. There's five. I have the fuck is this? Are these the chapters of the episode? You have text? Mess have an, a very special 18th birthday. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. T T Y L eighteen whole year. Who is this? I you are getting ignored. Yeah, don't ignore this. You're getting fucking ignored here. Whoever, what is your name? Warren. You're getting fucking ignored. If I've ever been extremely right. popular from the eighteen hundreds onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. There's nothing else for me to do on my desk. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. God's over! Hallelujah! a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can... I'd like to submit a picture of John Cena for my Everyday Heroes. together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max... I see you pretending not to see me. What do I put in my picture of John Cena into this contest? I'll fucking win if I put John Cena in this contest. You have a tablet? Of course. Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. If you're fucking 18 years old, you should not be saying bestest. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Because I am a respectful person, I will not touch your fucking tablet. Huh. This might make a cool shot. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel excluded from this process, but I also want everybody to know that this photographic work Hey Rachel Amber Forever, that's gonna that's it. Oh I got a trophy. Rachel and Amber Forever. That's sure gonna fucking last. Alright, that's gonna last What the fuck are you doing, Kate? Computer? Use a computer. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Cool. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to that's supposed to be Photoshop. Kate, you alive? Kate, talk to me. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. How did I embarrass you? Kate, I, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. I should get going, she says. Let's talk later, Max. Nowhere she goes. 
This paper ball. Oh, this paper ball. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Dear Kate, we love your porch. I'll say porn. I'll say porn. <gasps> Kate, you got a porn video? Oh, I could. I could go for some of that. You fucking stupid shit, you fucking snutty fucking bitch. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, FUCK please. YOU! Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. But life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young. The world is yours. Life will fucking do what I tell life to do, okay? You do have the gift. You have the fever to take images. To frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. That's what separates the artist from the amateur. Well, I mean, there was something about a porn video there. So technically, I'm already sharing, aren't I? Well, what the fuck? What the fuck? You see you know those people in the background? Like, they're not even walking. They're just like animatronics on the wall. Some fucked up school you got going on. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Smack that ass. See how you like that, bitch? Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images, but I still dig my little instant camera. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Wow, it's like transcending. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. I'm glad I'm learning about photography. I'm really happy and about that. He even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. No one's that excited about school. So I'm cool just, that I'm we just... can check these out anytime. The Decisive Moment by Henri mm -hmm. Cartier-Bresson. That's rare. Anyone it's not even English. Respect. The amazing Eugene Smith. Good to see Avedon among the masters. Golly, of course. Lots of people I haven't heard of yet. I guess that's why I'm here. Well, you know more than me. Here's the poster for the contest. Mr. Jefferson really expects me to enter. Why? I don't know if I'm ready for my 15 minutes of infamy. Where can I fucking put my photo of John Cena? I will put my photo into this contest and I will win this contest. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying on you. Welcome to the real world. Cute. Huh. Then I might send you a special <laughs> Fuck Lord. She plays it so I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Gotta take a shit in there? Is that what you gotta do? You gotta take a shit, Max? She's so fucking shy. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. I need the music that's going on. I love on. that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous, as usual. Stella is always deep in her nose. She didn't come to Blackboard and mess around. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone for months.
to all of you American girls in the movie. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown except for me. I can take my shit in peace. What does that say? What does that say? Now who would bother to write that crap? Rachel Amber is a bitch. Holy shit, they got mirrors working. Uh, El Mustachio. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's gotta be very quiet. You fucking stay, you fucking stay. Yeah! <laughs> Yo. What the fuck it's cool, is man. you? <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just come to three. What the fuck is you doing scared. in here? You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. Woo! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing oh, around he's... with. Got, got... That. What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! <gasps> oh! she, got, she just got shot! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. No. Can you give me an example what? of a photo? I cannot believe this. My camera. Black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Can I actually reverse time? Victoria, why Arvis? Ooh, look at this. I did it. I actually did it. Hashtag the camera. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. Oh, no. Why Arvis? Selfie! Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted when by When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Don't insult selfies, you fuck. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. So I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? Can I save her? Oh, I'm gonna save her. She had blue hair. I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? 
I was supposed to remember that? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody- Fuck shit. you! Jefferson wants to keep me after Most class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Stop! Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again process, and give him the right answer? People's faces, making them. Here we go. Here we go. Well, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I got it. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre. Around 1830. Somebody has been reading ho, as well ho, as posing. Ho, ho. Nice work, Max. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career Let me submit so my Stella picture Alyssa, of John Cena. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Talk to you again? Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just dripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. You have a chronic, chronic bitch face or something? want anybody to feel excluded from this process excuse me mr jefferson can i talk to you for a moment yes excuse you no victoria fuck excuse you us. you fucking I'd never bitch let photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture mm, I'm, not I'm not avoiding just biding time waiting for the elusive right moment exactly max don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is this what motherfucker's is quoting it. John Lemon. Huh? He must be a sophisticated Don't professor. I never talked to you at all. Fuck your John Lemon lecture, motherfucker. I see you, Max Caulfield. Mm. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Just let me leave. I never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. John Lemon said. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Good. Now shut the fuck up. Fuck you, John Lemon. I have to go take a shit. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't go tell anybody. Shit. They'll think I'm crazy. I have to go take a shit. I have to shit. Shit. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can Here we go. Everybody. Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? 
Come on, put that thing down. Here we go. Here we go. Save her. Save her. Hammer. To break it open. Hammer. Hammer. Going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Hammer. Nobody would hammer. Grab that hammer. Grab the hammer. Grab that hammer. Get that gun away from me, psycho. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. Fuck. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Here we go. No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? The Illuminati is what's going on. Freak out. Can you grab my photo? Just like grab that. No, go here. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. I was taking down. a shit. Out of here, Missy, or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Get wrecked. Get fucking wrecked. Get wrecked. Go, shoot. Thank you for saving me, my man. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I talk a shit. Uh... I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge I'll look into the matter personally thank you for bringing it to my attention that's it after what I told we'll you we'll continue this discussion later in my office please go outside with the rest of your class now Miss Caulfield of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now should I rewind and change my story maybe We go fast, please. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? I took a shit, you fucking well, fuck. Max, talk What's wrong with taking a shit in the bathroom? I just got sick in class. Um, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with the class. Please. No, he does not fire that at all. 
I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Either way, I get fucked. I get fucked either way. So, you know, fuck you. I'll stick to that. Either way, you get fucked. You tell him the truth. He doesn't do shit. You try to fucking lie. And he just fucking insults you. Those are some poppins if I've ever seen them. It's a nice little skull. It's a nice little skull. Look at that squirrel there. Look at that squirrel. Alright, if this was realistic, squirrels would fucking move if you get that close to them. Who is you? Talk. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? No. No. Sure, I always have time for you. No. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Who's Rachel? I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless our soul. Oh, the missing. But missing. this petition missing isn't about hey. her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land, to the pioneers who shared it in peace. Not fear and violence. Blackwell is that old? That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. No, oh, my juices are flowing, that's for sure. Lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? I, I sort of want cameras. Miss Grant, I totally respect your passion and knowledge, but some security cameras make me feel a little safer. I'm not against security, Max. We should all be concerned when private space becomes public. Your generation has been tricked to think everything should be recorded. How the fuck? What kind of consequences is that going to have? What the fuck is this? So he, she actually answered him? She actually answered him. That's okay, surprising. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. In which direction is your dorm? Ha which direction is your dorm, woman? All right, those are all the pictures I could take then, I guess. Right. What the fuck, Nathan? Right. Fuck you. Don't lay in the grass. How do I get to my fucking dorm? Please, just tell me how do I get to my dorm. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I um ask you a question? Would fat you guy. mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Sure. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh. She was a natural. So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweat. 
sweet face used as a crime photo. Uh, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute, Muse. So that's all I am, a fucking substitute. I see oh, how you are. That's a good posture. This is gonna look fucking ugly, Good. isn't it? Best portrait ever. You're gonna kill yourself if you keep doing that. Yo, stop. Stop it. Stop. Was that. Was that, was that, was that, was that, was that stop. Stop it! Yeah, he won. Yeah. Oh! You just can't kick flip through me like that. Who oh, give me those coins? This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. Can I, oh, shit in the fountain! Take a shit in the fountain. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason, and I have to find out why. All right, you can get up. What's us. All right, dorms are over there. Who are you? Oh, Stella. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? No. No. I'm not sure yet. I mean, he's clearly a genius, but I don't agree with everything he says. He does get a bit pretentious, but he's passionate and just says what he thinks. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Oh, no, 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 no. No way. You can get him so busted. And he's not going to mess around with a student. That's what you think. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I heard that from a good source. I'm sure you fucking so, did. You knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind no, of No, no. You do not spell fucking kids with a Z. You don't do that. No. No, 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 no. That's so cool that Blackwell is doing a show of Mr. Jefferson's work. No, 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 no. Justin? Yo, Justin, Justin Bieber? Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Thrash? Uh, that's it. Thrash? You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Check out. I came to no slide. I came to no slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Let me do that. Let me see that tree flip. tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. He broke his balls! Yo, yo, your balls. Thank you. Thank you for that. Your balls will be remembered. Rest in peace, balls. Hey, 
I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You never really escaped Betty, though. I used to be, but I'm into my camera now. I can tell. We need more girls out here. Rachel Amber and her punk friend used to skate with us. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. Is that the one in the bathroom? She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. <laughs> Ran away. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. Do you ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. My man! My man! Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Appreciate that. I appreciate that. Yeah. Alright, so is it just me or those just... Those, no, those aren't people. They're just... Like... Sticks. Those aren't animated. They're sticks. The people on the football field out there, they're just... Sticks. What's can I talk? Hello. Alright. What's can I talk to? Hello? No. Hello? That Brooke? Hi, Brooke Summer? Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? This is legal. Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? Uh, you read what? too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Hi, Brooke. Right, right, I, 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 it appears I did the wrong thing. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. Alright, either way, I ain't getting to fly the fucking drone. What the fuck is this? So, so, so you're surrounded by uh, two ladies here, huh? 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 Hmm? Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, alright. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. You mean hang with the Vortex Club? That sounds like a setup to a horrible prank. Chillax, paranoia girl. We're not that desperate for fun. We know how to do that on our own. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. Do you really bitch. want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Fair enough, but I'm still not going to party with him. Your loss, bro, is fucking hilarious when he's blazed. And he, he does fucking shot that, shit. that girl. He is not right in the fucking head. So you he know Rachel Amber. I ain't gonna fucking party with you. She liked the fucking party. stupid <laughs> fucking psycho. Around. Oh yeah, and she was hot. This is a lot of conversation. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. 
She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Just don't bring Nathan and I'll be fucking fine. I'm almost sure Warren has the same bag. It looks a bit nerdy though. No, I would search that, but... Mm, no. No. Is anyone else down here? Nice. Some nice cleavage. So bizarre to be back here after five years. I thought I could just fit right back in at school. But with all this shit going on, I'm even more an outsider. And who can I confide in besides my journal and my camera? Man, these are supposed to be the best years of my life. This is what it's like to be alone and feel lonely at once. It's pressing. Now's not the time to be sad. We have to go back to the door. You can cry. You're squirrel! Fuck it. Get out here. Get out here. Get out here. You can cry and de be depressed later. Hey, I'm gonna take it. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. You never saw that? You never saw that? If I saw that, can I, can I? Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. Hmm. I, I, I know the name of it now. Let me fucking fly it. The fuck out of here. He's, uh, dorms are the way that way. Okay. Talk to you. Can't talk to you. Oh, who's this out here? Who's this? Evan, Evan Peters? Evan Peters. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? <laughs> oh! Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but... You should know the difference. Good try. Wrong answer. Try again. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're worthy of it, Matt. Steve McCurry. Uh, Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. McCurry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. I'm gonna get a fucking look at this portfolio, you motherfucker. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're. Robert! Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Alright, by process of elimination, I figured it out, okay, motherfucker? So I'm getting hey, a peek Evan. at what you got going Let's on see here. If you're... Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's yes. not a privilege I grant you. Yes! Any. Yes! I'm honored, sir. Let's take a look at this. Let's take a fucking look at this. We got some pictures of Rachel and some abstract landscapers. Fascinating. Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. You were close. Like brother and sister in arms. She understood me, never judged me. I hated her vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Her friends were her friends. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. 
My guess. She wanted to take a shit in that bathroom. Never came back. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. She wanted to take a shit and instead of the shit going down the toilet, it just sucked her entire body down with her. Bruh? So bruh is my favorite word, bruh. A whole new color for cast of characters to talk to. Why would I look at this fucking po- oh. What's the direction? Talk to me, bruh. Bruh. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. I gotta be so rude, bruh. What about you? Are you a dick? Football, Max. Big football. Step away. Wow, fucking football day. Oh, Kate. 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 Glad to see our campus is eco friendly. It's fascinating, Kate. Hello. Hi, Kate. Sweet. Hey, Max. How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything? Awesome. Max, I'd like to be alone if you don't mind. I'm sorry. I may have fucked that up. Wait, no, go back. Ah, what the fuck? Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to... Nice, bro. I guess I'll, I'll accept that. You were sitting over here. F Alyssa? Oh. Hi, Max. You sound fucking as enthralled to see me, I'm being honest with you. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. Dude. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Wow. I'm glad I talked to you. You seem so... <laughs> Interesting. Don't take it out on the tree, loser. <laughs> Rachel owes me money. Pay up, bitch. <laughs> what? With all these new droughts, it seems kind of obscene to waste all this water. Shut the fuck up. With all these new droughts, it seems kind of obscene to waste all this water. Shut the fuck up. Oh, I gotta prepare myself for this. Oh. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What? You just said me, bitch. Gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. What the fuck are you saying, bitch? Processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got yeah. your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers. I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh wait, hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. I will take my selfie, I will fucking fold it into a goddamn swan, and I will shove it up so far up your fucking vagina, you're gonna be shitting out origami for a fucking year. Do you understand me? Do you fucking understand me? Do you fucking understand what I'm saying to you right now? No. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Can I do something Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? That's a good fucking question. Nice ass. Oh, oh look at that. You got some... 
some paint up there. Can I, I can't climb. Can no. Sprinkler valve should be down here. Right, be nice. Oh, is that enough to rule my sea? This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Looks easy enough to use, huh? Okay. So why can I use it? This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. So use it. What? I need to figure this out. There we go. What the hell? Are you kidding? That's what you get, you fucking bitch. Just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. That's what you fucking get, you fucking bitch. Thank you. Thank you for that. That's what you get, you fucking bitch. What we learn? What we learn? Do you, do you understand English? Get lost. Oh, wait, the paint. El, el Painto. No, fuck. Get back there. Get the fuck back there, Samuel. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh, oh. No way. <gasps> That's what oh, you Sorry. get. You hey, pain is not bitch. Good for hair. No. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. No. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. What we learn to wait. Ah. Uh. Oh, uh, is that is that a paintbrush just uh sitting up there? I was about, it's Sam Samuel How you get your paintbrush to just sit up there like that? Excuse me, I'm coming through now. Uh hey Victoria. What do you want, Max? Let's see how this goes. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Oh, Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Let me in, you fucking whore! You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. No. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Let me in! Move your fucking wet ass out of my way! Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. You better be nice to me. You better fucking be nice to me. By the end of this fucking game, you better be kissing my fucking sweet ass. You understand me? Your friends don't care about you. They're sluts. You said it yourself. I care. I'll turn you from a snotty bitch into a kind-hearted woman. Wasn't he? Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if AIDS? I will, AIDS? Uh, to the bitch that stole my stole my creme, my cream. That was expensive shit, and I did it for my ex. 
balcony. Wow. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. It took so long. Room 217. No way in hell am I ever Red room? here. What's wrong with that room? Taylor is a slave. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. As if. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. Juliet, extreme reporter. Pretty sure Victoria would allow some boys in here if you know what I mean. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, what the fuck? Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Could be fun. Thanks for the warning. Hmm. Fantastic. I want to take a shit in the shower. Hey, just let me in there. Take a shit. I'll shit over the drain. Just let me in there, please. I want to take a shit in the shower. Whoa. Peace. Peace. Kiflum. Kiflum. Brother. Kiflum. 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 Can you swim to success? No. Kiflum, brother. Kiflum. Brother, brother. Kiflum. Kiflum. What's this? Oh, Victoria. Give me a fucking break. So my room is right across from Victoria's room. That's... That's... What the fuck is this? What the... F what... what? Is, is this supposed to be Fear of the Forks? You're so, like, what the fuck is this? There's a giant fucking apple. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Pie. Hashtag, hashtag pie. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. I will draw something amazing. You just fucking watch. Better not be a peace sound. They'll connect the dots real fucking quick. Obvious, but true. That's better than the peace sign. There's a teddy bear. I could oh, have home. sex with that teddy bear. I want to have se I'll have sex with that with that teddy bear. Teddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I what? fuck off, mom. Fuck off, mom. Followed fuck off, your mom. Eye and my parents rushed me to the ER. I knew we were bonded forever. Power strip. Power strip. The Max Caulfield photo memorial wall. The Max Caulfield photo memorial wall. I know, say. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Graphic life altering controversial nature. Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Been fascinating. What? Oh, photo myself? Oh, 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 mirror selfie. Oh! That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. So is that all the fucking trophies for her in this game? Taking pictures? Oh, cookies? I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. It's not well, exactly pretty and Was pink, that gift certificate no for Starbucks? Huh? I like my wardrobe. Is that Johnny Depp? Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? Johnny Depp. Play the guitar. Play the guitar. Here we go. Through the fire and the flames, we carry on. Here we go. Let's go. Here we go.
That's enough of that. The winger and the cow. Just some fucking weird shit in your room. My dad. Go Thunderbird. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. Who the fuck reads nowadays? I get uh, who reads. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. You porn in there. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HD TV. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks. Track me down my room. You fucking. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. I needed that. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. Alright, alright. Put that on I there. am so addicted to this site. Look at Camera porn! Movies. Why the fuck are you on a website called Camera Porn? Porn makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Camera works. Right, you're going to have one friend. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. That's a player's theater. Players. Play us. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Play? Hashtag tag team match player? I could have had music this whole time. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. You guys have a breakup or something? Cartier Bresson, Doino, Hamilton, the greatest. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. I never opened this, did I? Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. It's your special day. That's fucking adorable. Take a fucking nap. Take a shit in this bed. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. No, we're not putting any Inception shit into this game, all right? So Inception is like two tiers above what my brain can handle. So we're gonna keep it, we're gonna keep it, you know, simple, okay? I know what room I need to go to. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. What the fuck is this? Come on, Dana, I'll save the day. I'll save you, Dana. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh... Uh, uh, uh. Watson makes the most sense to me. Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. 
I didn't even think you knew. I got it right. Oh, I got it. Of fucking I do. right. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sex, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Matt, Ooh. I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Victoria, huh? Victoria. <gasps> Victoria's room was this one, right? No, not that one. This, this one. I'm, uh, I'm a, I'm a creep on in here. Excuse me. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a creep on in here. You got a tet? Oh, I have a fucking field day with that. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. She probably. You have a TV, Jesus Christ. Alright, I should probably just hurry up and find what I fucking need. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. English, please. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. You know, if you submit that fucking picture, John Cena, everything would be okay. But no, you won't. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? <laughs> Bitch! How insecure. Bitch! You have books? She reads books. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. She reads books? This bitch reads books? God damn. I didn't expect you. I'll just use the tablet. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. I could print me out some John Cena's with those. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. How do I print this? How do I print this? How do I print this? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Grab it. Here we, go. we gotta get out quick. Here we go. Where's that? Where's the printer? Uh, printer, 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 hey, 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 printer. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. She's gonna be right there when we go. She's gonna be what? Cool. Speaking of selfies. I ain't gonna mess her shit up. Leave her shit alone. Never knew I was there. Never knew I was there. <laughs> I'm like a fucking mouse. <laughs> I'm like a mouse. Here you go. Here you go. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Cover up that fucking strap. Alright. Alright, Max is 18. How fucking old are you to have those big ass titties? Almost right. done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Like, seriously, how old are you? How old are you? You got, you got some boobies on you. But I'm I'm 18 and I, I don't got none. So how old are you? Like 29? 29 going to college? I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. You have like nothing in your fucking room. It would be a cool sticker without the words. This is both sad and pathetic. I gotta read this. I still... I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumb ass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, and but I never but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I post out. Mm. Mm. That's sad. Sad. Wanna talk? Hey Dana. Seriously. Thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. 
Real mature. She, get, she gets her rage out. Oh! Poor Juliet gets her rage on. I hope she doesn't kill Victoria. Zachary should worry too. As if I'd let that ego case jockstrap touch me. But I bet Victoria would be all over that action. Or has been. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. Mm, seems like seems like this uh, Warren fella in a enjoys this here Max laptop. Was on the laptop. Of course, a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. So fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. All right, this is supposed to be like Facebook. What? Why the fuck do you have subscribers? I don't. I don't. What the fuck? I don't fucking understand that. Oh, Super Mario. Trevor was playing Super Mario. But what fucking website is this? You can't combine YouTube and Facebook and Twitter and Tumblr into one. Take that. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. No! Don't do that! Ever again! Please, God! Don't do that again! What the fuck do you want? It took you half an hour to get this shit! It took me half an hour to get this shit, god damn! I'm a coming! Thankfully, there aren't any fucking loading screens in this goddamn game. Fuck this shit. What? Ow. What? That hurt. What? Damn, I better rewind. Oh. Talk to you. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. You're welcome. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. Respect me. That was close. Jock assholes. If I was a member of the Vortex Club, they'd never pull that. Would you want to be a member? They're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid Respect. Book. The nerd! You fucking, you fucking asshole! You fucking threw! You fucking threw! You fucking threw that fucking football! You fucking threw that football at her! You would, you could have fucking killed her! You fucking understand me? Fuck you! You fucking fat! I've, where I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. This way, right? So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Uh, I'll take a photo. Evidence. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Evidence. Evidence. I'll use it against you, you fuck. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. I was gonna use... Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over... I'm gonna use it for fucking evidence! I could rewind and try something different. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. 
Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. There, are you happy now? You happy with that? I helped you. You happy? Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Oh. I was I gonna everyday hero take Kate, but the photo officer and use it as after me. evidence. Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business. It's gonna use it as evidence. Take it to the fucking printer like, yo, he's bullying here, but no, no, she gets all in the fucking see fit if I do that. It's hard to please fucking everyone in this godforsaken school. Fuck. I like how when the screen goes black, it still shows the USB up there. Can we talk to more characters? Okay, he's back there. Can I talk to everyone else before I get to you? Like, you're just gonna wait there. I'm gonna go talk to the bitch sitting over there. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. I'm just gonna explore everything before I come talk to you. Is that okay? Oh, she's she's crying. I, I gotta go uh, com comfort her. I better go there soon to see if Joyce is still there, and get a burger. Oh, look, look at the graffiti. Good thing I don't have a car yet. Who toilet papers a bike? Someone, someone who uh, doesn't need to take a shit. That's who. The whole town is turning into one giant missing persons poster. Damn. Somebody is seriously devoted to putting up these posters. She's probably putting up the posters herself. Probably wearing a disguise, putting them up herself, trying to create whole drama so the goddamn world revolves around her. Is this? I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Tard. I can't. I can't read that last word there. I don't get it. How could Zach and Victoria do that to me? Hello? Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. You'll live. You can live. You'll find Juliet. You will find your Romeo. And you will you will appreciate him when he comes out. That is a... S God damn, that is a small car. Yo, Max. Check it out. No. No. No, you see my ass? You see my ass? You can look at my ass as I walk away. I like that. Look at Warren and his Wayback Machine. He's a brave man. It would seem... Uh, why the fuck do two people drive this small-ass car? Jesus fucking God. Damn. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. What? You're in the wrong time. Man. 65 but then miles? So am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. Go 60 miles in a car with you? Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd 60 miles, miles in a car with you now? No. No. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. <laughs> you can draw? I thought you were blinded by science, not art. Art is science. Music is math, etc., etc. I'd put Stephen Hawking against Picasso any day. Hardcore. 
So you must use a computer to draw? Of course. I'd love to tweak one of your selfies with some cool graphics. That might not suck. I'll let you know. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Booty, 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 yeah, booty, booty, everywhere. You had some cool shit on there, booty, booty, from booty, Akira booty, to Twilight Zone, which booty, seems booty, apropos booty, today. I consider booty, myself booty, a pop booty, cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Twilight, you're talking about Twilight, aren't you? Love sensitive vampires you're talking about Twilight, aren't so you? So you're sensitive. <laughs> Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Mm. Mm. Even myself. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I said I didn't want to talk about I mean, it. Why are you fucking telling life -changing. him? Life-changing. Why are you fucking telling him? Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? Um. You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? Hello? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you saw. Now. Answer me, bitch. Nothing but a butterfly. You're full of shit. I'd respect you more if you told me the truth. I don't need your respect. You're clueless. You have no idea who I am or what I can do. Actually, I have a pretty good idea of who you are. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Oh. Oh. Hey, leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait in the down. bathroom! <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go, go, I got this. Bit of that. Bit of mess. Get your punk asses out of there now. Don't even try to run. Nobody. Nobody. Could have sex with that bobblehead too. Nathan Prescott is messed up. And dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend only really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No, 
You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Not everything changes, except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage, and he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. not nice to talk about your step douche like that, Chloe. It's a nice truck. Come a on very in. nice Don't truck. Be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Step douche, home, shit, home. You're a bundle of fucking joy, aren't you? There's, a, there's some cleavage over there in the corner. It's uh, very enjoyable. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Oh, you're a drug addict. Oh, no. Bad. What the fuck is this? This postcard is from Rachel Ember. Hmm. Rachel and Chloe were friends. That's interesting. I'm just gonna go through your shit. We'll we had such a blast drawing these together. Pow the Power Girls. All right. Power Puff Girls. You know, okay. I'm just gonna go through your shit. I hope you know that. And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. Dude, you brought my glass snow dough. Thanks. Sorry. I'll put it back. It's good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all fine. I never oh, broke this it. This is a flashback to you. Our super secret closet lair. I'm gonna go through this shit though. If I break Chloe anything, totally I'll fix it. changed her style. I barely recognized her. Yeah, you just saved her from getting fucking shot. Chloe was Suck always it. taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Dad is gone. It's depressing, Chloe. Nothing but junk in this suitcase. Alcohol, cigarettes. All you do is fucking drugs, woman. Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. Three thousand dollars. What's in here, Chloe? Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. El gato. El, el gato in that picture. El gato. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. Fix that in a minute. I'm not into them. Too pretentious. Now, let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days. Does she keep her fucking music? Let me use your laptop real quick. She looks super happy. Of course, you, you gotta take a selfie with the bong because nothing. You, you just have to. You just have to. So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. 
What do you got in your garbage, Chloe? Who'd have thought Chloe wouldn't pay her parking tickets? She does love trouble. Under your bed, Chloe. I got El Tipo. Hey, give me that. Sorry, oh. I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. Putting it mildly. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. I see why. I bet your mom was not too happy. She was happy enough to marry a Nazi. Reason number 356 to escape. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you... And Rachel, gone. Can you put on some music now? Chloe has had a pretty shitty life. I'll, I will fucking say that. You've had a shitty life. What's on your desk first? Is this a desk or a storage space? Stop doing drugs, cigarettes, and alcohol, and bongs. Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Where's my 420 blaze it joke, Chloe? No, Max, this isn't a tool shed. Like I said, check the garage. Where's my Where's my 420 joke, Matt? Chloe, Max, Chloe, Chloe, Max. Where's my 420 joke? Just you just you just can't you just can't do that without my 420 joke. Whoa, dark. I cannot see anything. This is definitely Joyce's makeup. Chloe wouldn't use animal products. I hope Chloe isn't taking these pills. I like Chloe's new hair color. She's the opposite of shy. Of me. Chloe, I hope you don't mind. Oh, better turn that off. Hope you don't mind me going through your entire fucking house. I'm just you know, I like looking at shit. You can't go home again, said Thomas Wolf. But here I am. These books have not been touched since the last decade. 
I see why. This must be Chloe's parents' room. Man, I am nosy today. You smacked the window, you fuck! You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. I smacked the fucking window. Oh, Joyce has a little shrine to William. Her new husband may not be such a douche. Joyce always loved her mail order catalogs of useless crap. Act, react, or die. A 21st century survival. I don't give a fuck about that book with any dog tags. Sweet. David Matson. Yo, bird, you better bow down to me as your new savior. You will start a religion in my name after that, bird. Oh my. Chloe made this for Joyce on Mother's Day years ago. I see why she would keep it. Joyce still works at the diner. Is her husband a cop? Poor Chloe. Uh oh. The prices are late on their bills. That's how much? How much? How much is that? Is that four thousand three hundred ninety-nine dollar? That's a lot of money. Joyce looks happy. Chloe's stepdad might not be a douchebag after all. But but you see, Chloe doesn't like him, so he's a douche. Okay? He's just a douche automatically if Chloe doesn't like him. That bird smack in the window made my day. That made my fucking day. Doesn't look like the Price family is rolling in dough these days. I was about to get mad if my game fucking shit itself. Oh, what you, what you, what do you got around here? Now this is the Chloe I remember. Always smiling and laughing. Not so much anymore. You see the butt on that one? Some good butt. Kate, what do you want? You, I don't, I don't understand if you have a phone why you keep, uh... I missed a lot of photos, apparently. Man, yeah, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. Look at that, that cat. That is a nice cat. Stop with the fucking. Stop with the fucking. Golden stars. Stop with the golden stars, please. Thank you. No, I don't want. I don't want to watch that. What was I say? I'm just gonna turn on all of your lights. I'm gonna go through your entire fucking house. I'd love to go to Paris too. At this rate, they'll be lucky to get to Portland. I'm gonna go through your Joyce entire house, and you're gonna diner. respect me for it, okay, Best Chloe? Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Joyce still works at Two Wells Diner. Best damn burgers. In I Arcadia. thought I thought the butter said butthole, and I was gonna get upset real quick. You have stains on the floor? Hey, I remember that stain. Chloe and I knocked over Joyce's wine bottle and we scrubbed forever, but it never came out. We got so busted. I'm just gonna sit on your couch, Chloe. Come this on, is my house now. Hold on, and I'm not chicken. Prove it. You drink first, Max. No way. It was your idea, Chloe. Whatever. Give me that bottle. Well, tasty. Very tasty. 
Here, I, I want to sip. Sorry, this is not for kids. Don't be greedy. Give me some. Oh shit, the carpet! There's wine all over. What do we do now? My parents are coming. Cover it up. Good flashback. Flashback. Memories. Good memories. If I took this picture, the deer would be standing on your ass. Can't say ass. Yum, that looks tasty. I do miss Joyce's cooking. What? What? Call her by Joe. Chloe, if you're listening, Pete was cruising home off duty and told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered. Told you to stay away from that place. It's dangerous. And you got no idea what kind of scum are living out there. Stay away. I'm serious. He doesn't sound like the nicest guy. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. I guess they're aging these books. He doesn't sound like the nicest guy. I should in the be hood. able to find the tools I need here. All right, All right tools are in there. What's out here? I'm going outside, Chloe. It's my backyard now. Brr. I can feel autumn pushing out to summer. William used to grill awesome burgers for us. I wonder if he was the last one to use this. That is great. We oh, made this dog. food for Chloe's kitty. Okay. Hmm? Poor Bongo. He never saw that car coming. Mm, you named the fucking thing Bongo. Just that why? That took Chloe and me the whole day to draw. It's almost invisible now. Why would you name your cat Bongo? He probably he was probably glad he fucking died. It wouldn't have to be called Bongo anymore. Truly want to do when you grow up, Max. I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world. Go far from here. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. I would be like Lara Croft, except real. That would be majorly cool. Totally. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us what to do. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love to be a photographer. As if I ever could be. What are you talking about? Max, you are a photographer. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. I believe in you. That's enough for miss reminiscing. Reminiscing. I I have some fucking investigating to do in this backyard before. Never mind. It's about all there is in the backyard. Open the door. Can I go down to the front porch and get your mail, Chloe? I want to know what kind of mail you got. Nope. Someone locked it from the other side. Can't go outside? Alright, fine. I'll go fuck get my tools. Hello? Tool? Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? Was that the asshole yelling at the other girl? I mean, the asshole yelling at her had a mustache. Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? He must really hate her. I mean, unless there's another one. Unless there's another asshole with a mustache at that school. I'm pretty sure that was her, that was her stepdad. Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. Yes! You have some very fucked up thoughts going on in your mind, Max. El, El, El Caro. Poor little dear. It's not enough to kill you. They have to display your head. Look at all that food. 
That's like enough spam for a hundred years. That's not even spam. That's not, that's not even spam. There's tomatoes and cereals and corns up there. That's not even spam, you fucking dumb bitch. Cool. Now it's open. Wow, that was... Ooh, that was riveting. Ooh, that was riveting. Open that door. Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. Hmm, files? Oh, Shit. fucking god! Butterfingers! Nope. Wait, no, there's a picture. There's a picture in there. Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. I knew, I fucking knew he was the one looking at her. Alright, go back up. I knew he was fucking look. I knew that was the one looking at her. I fucking called. Did I call it? I called it. Wasn't he? Corned beef. Sounds, sounds appetizing. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. Oh no. Let me whip out my fucking phone and call up Tim the Tool Man to give you some tiny tools. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Hmm. Mm, interesting. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? Why am I, am I just... The reason for me to be looking at this? Alright, undo that. Never happened. Never happened. Never happened. So where the fuck are my tiny tools then? Nothing. This is so lame. I already opened these, didn't I? Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? He must really hate her. Where the fuck are my tiny tools then? Chloe, you don't got no tools down here for me. Chloe, you don't got no tools no for me. To go there now. What the, where the fuck are the tools, Max? Max, there aren't any there aren't any fucking tools down here. I don't want to look at these creepy photos again. Why does David have them? Where where do I get my tools, Chloe? Chloe, where do I got my Chloe's tools? Up. Chloe, where are my Max? Who well, whoever, where are my tools? Hmm? 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 Not in here. There aren't, there aren't any tools in there, so I don't need that open. Where the fuck are my tools? I where are my tools? These are wait. Oh oh. Boom! Precision screwdrivers. Except. I can't reach them. Get down here. Get down here. Come to daddy. Yes. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Turn that off. I was never I was never down here. I never turned that on. Give me my tools. Man, 
I should have done that before they fell. Oh. <laughs> zing zing. Hey, no, come to daddy. Come to daddy. Come on. <laughs> give me them. Give me them tools. Give me them. Give me them tools. Yes, you have mad skills, Max. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Chloe, are you you're still alive, right? I mean, those you didn't fucking like OD or anything on me, did you? Please be alive, Clo closer. Closer. Chloe. Fuck, she's dead. Oh no, she's moving. You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Mm. You understand your dad's like a fucking creep. Down there, right? I regret agreeing that the school needed cameras now. The school need does not need cameras installed from him. <laughs> so? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. You're welcome. Now tell me the truth, Max. You're welcome. How's it? I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? No. No, no. Not at all. Your hair and clothes are so different. I hope so. I'm sure this is all so weird to you after coming back. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? No, I didn't know what to do. I don't blame you. That's some intense shit. Maybe I should go to the principal. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I learned that. Seriously, I didn't blab to anybody. Promise. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Respect me! I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so I would cool prefer to dildo. My birthday, but I can't take this. Of course I would have wanted a dildo. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> take that photo. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Do 
Dude, the music's not even on! Asshole. I'm coming up. You need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, I'll take that stop. closet. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Fuck. Just let me in. Okay, you can't we can't know that. Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in. In we go. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. Shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat will do that to you. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You're tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon. Hey, leave Joyce out of this. I wish you'd leave Joyce, like now. <laughs> Chloe, I'm sorry. I care about your mother and you just keep pushing me. Don't touch me again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast. You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Hey, you okay? Welcome to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? He would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? Lord Chloe said that staying hidden was the right idea. Damn, what are you waiting for? So, Open the window. so staying hidden is, is my choice that I will go with. Staying hidden. Staying hidden. I made the right choice. I made the right choice. Because if he saw me, he'd probably fucking throw me out that fucking window. I don't want to be thrown out that window. I'll fucking stay hidden. And she'll take the slap. Or she'll take one for the team. And then come back later and I'll fucking kick his ass with my fucking ninja skills that I apparently have. And it'll all end up nice and peachy. Creepy fucking mustache stalker. There! Baby! I haven't been here in forever, so why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa. Not remember your dream? This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Oh, really now? That's fucking cool. Yo, where's Chloe? Yo, you just can't, you can't leave me hanging, Chloe. Chloe, you can't leave me hanging. Chloe. Wait, bird. I got you. Suck my ass, Robin. They haven't updated this sign since the 1980s. Where the fuck is Chloe? You can't just bring me up here and fucking run away. You can't fucking do that. What the fuck is wrong with you, Chloe? Hello, cute little squirrel. You and me, stare contest. Nope. Why would you run away? I want the stare contest though. I want the stare contest. You fan of where we fucking ran away? Cause you some some garbage that sticks out like a sore thumb. 
I want steering contest. What do you want? He looks nice. He'll get laid by the Birds end of this so game. Lucky. They can always escape. He'll get laid, believe me, he'll get laid. He'll get bored. When did you get up here? Wowzer, Chloe drew that to mark our tree for it. So we'd always be able to find each other in case of emergency. Wow! Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. A tree haiku? How pretty. Fuck poetry. How long has that been here? Look at that gorilla. Clearly, the Bigfoots are everywhere. Oh, you know they are. Those sure aren't big feet. What kind of animal left those prints? Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. All right, Chloe, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Don't don't, don't talk like that. Like, speak English for me, Too Chloe. Bad it's Max, I God, damn, I'm losing steps. it. No. Chloe, and Max, are the, they're the same character. It's the same character. Doesn't matter who's who. Everyone's the same. It's all that matters in life. How'd you get up here so fast? Sure, you don't want to be alone. Sit down if you want. Are you pissed at me? I just wanted some backup. I'm not as brave as you, and David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah, I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it. He's so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. Even yours? Even what? yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perp was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. 
That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Good thing you didn't tell anyone. Nathan Prescott better watch his back now. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. We don't talk about that game. You never talk about Destiny. Yeah, that game was a fucking bad game. I'm trying to ignore that as best as I can. Do not bring that up. Just don't fucking bring that up. Don't bring that up. Life will be good. The more I think about that game, the more I want to fucking off myself. <laughs> if this is Destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. that I would dare bam bam follow that dare follow that dare follow that dare come to dare 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 come to daddy come to daddy you fucking dare god to find out Tree. Get squished by the tree. <laughs> Got squished by the tree, that's fun. Bambi. Come. No, come here, you fucking Bambi. Oh no. Oh. Wait, no. I'm supposed to let that go down, aren't I? Goodbye. Come here, you fucking Bambi bitch. Come here. Let me pet you. Let me touch you. I want to touch you. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! Fuck it! Woo! Oh, I see where I'm going. Hey, wait for that to move. Hey, hey. Move! Move! What are you doing? Oh! Get that newspaper. Newspaper. Yeah. There we go. I won. I won. Fuck that. I got. I got time travel. Is this Friday? That's only four days away. Oh no! The tornado is headed straight for the town. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real. It's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But I, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day.
hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Fuck that asshole. Oh, the episode actually had a name? Huh. That, was, that was something interesting. I definitely enjoyed that. <laughs>